Hello, I'm Frankie. And I'm Rachel. And welcome back to our Let's Play of The Witcher Free Blood and Wind expansion. Now, in the last one, we just totally kicked ass. Well, first we struggled a little bit in Gwent. Yeah, then I wouldn't we... exactly say kicked ass. But then we kicked ass in the challenge, is what I was saying about kicking ass about. We did. Yeah. So, let's go and investigate. What is her name? Lady Vivian or something like that? Mm hmm. Let's investigate her tent. Yeah, let's go now. This is her tent. You must look inside. Search it. I shall hoot like an owl should someone approach. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Ah. Scratches. Claw marks. That's clear. Not sure what beast left them. Just oh, that it's big. Dear Vivian, thou hast doffed eyes within thy locks. Thy lips are like a shut up and scarlet. pay attention. Thy two breasts. Jar of concealing ointment. Powerful magic at work here. Concealing ointment. Clothing's all dark green and yellow. Seems Yen's not the only one with a fixed color scheme. Nails and salts. Hmm. Used to make compresses. Hey, what? I, I don't... Someone approaches quickly. That's not an owl who. That's the funny sound of an owl. Someone approaches. We're supposed to hoot. We shall speak later. We must return to the tourney now. It's it's time for the second contest. Sirs, what seeks you in my lady's tent? Inspiration? Be gone from here. Oh dear. Okay. Well. Why were you in there? Uh, tourney business. Nothing of import. Huh. Let's see if um this uh new um crossbow I got is better than my one. It is by four. Geralt of Rivia's crossbow. Should we have that since it's got our like house? Why not? Yeah. Let's have a little sneak for what it looks like. Not bad. Not bad at all. Looks quite nice. Okay. Now. I would love to find our tent with our crest on it. So that's the tawny ground. I want to have another check. It must be here somewhere. Oh, is that it? No. Rose. We're looking for a blue bridge. Oh, is that? Ah, here it is. Our tent. Oh, we got loot. We got loot in our tent. What we got? To Saint Ducal's garden armor. This point. Hmm. Yum yum yum. What's that? An invitation to the hare hunt. Our new bed has arrived. Hey. What's this? The hare's been up to all sorts of mischief. While the unicorn slept, he stole his horn. When the phoenix was away, he stole its egg. And he plucked the golden fish from King Cormorant's pond. The supreme court of creatures thus called for a hare hunt. And that cowardly beast ran off fast as he could, losing all his prizes along the way, and found himself a hiding place. Answer the court's call and head to the palace gardens to join the hare hunt. Recover all the hare's prizes? Find the hare himself, and you shall receive your just reward. In the name of her illustrious highness, the Supreme Court of Creatures. Cool. Is that a new quest that we just got then? Noble Alondra. Don't want to read that now. Quillarm. Quillarm scrap paper? What's that? Oh, fair Vivienne, thou hast dove's eyes within thy, lo within thy locks. Thy lips are like a thread of scarlet. Crossed out. Thy two breasts are like jugs of milk. Yeah, you should have crossed out. Crossed out. Thy two breasts are like young rows that are twin. Uh, yeah, crossed out. Illegible line. Thy hands are like two white moons. When, oh, when shall thou glance at me? What a hopeless romantic. I don't use crossbow bolts because I just can't bother to keep replacing them. Well, I'm glad we 
Went into our tent. We got a quest from there. Look at that. We look like nobles. Beautiful. Well. Let's go to the entrance of the racing course. Shut up. Crazy woman. Ooh. Actually, I see. I think... I think Geralt was feeling mighty thirsty. Let's go get a drink. Since there's a drink just down here. Why not? Hello, Inky. Drink, please. Welcome, welcome. Tell me what you'd like. Show me your ribs. Oh, you can't actually drink. Show me what you have to sell. What's she selling? Isn't that a shame? She does have alcohol. I was hoping to have like a little drinking animation. Uh, she, I can't sell stuff to her neither. Never mind. So long. I know. Eat, drink, and be merry. Thus make the prophet love your daughter. Let's uh, oh, one way. Let's go. Let's go and join. The horse racing. No, I don't know if this game. Haired witcher. I've seen it done before, but where? Good tidings. Oh, let's go. Behold, gallant knights and ladies, the chorus. Gaze at the host assembled. That better not be our horse. Look upon chivalry's best and most storied. Come from far lands. Here to seek glory. Hear now their names as I shout them aloud. Save her their titles of their presence. Be proud. Palmerin nice horse. Holy shit. Linus of Metida. Linus. Ringfarn of Atra. Hormakaspar of Maked. Dunimir of Troy! Guy de Boisfren! In service to the Duchess! Delwyn of Craigiao! Count Ty of Dondal! And say of Lilia and Rivia a Prince! Geralt of Rivia! Where's our horse? That wasn't our horse. Why have we got such a shit looking horse with throat? The faint power of silence, Tony Champion from last year. Today's winner of contests, his victory to secure, shall face a great war in a challenge Whoa. severe. I'm not going to fight. He's like a fucking mountain, that guy. Do you? Does ignorance demand a bard in deceit? Does someone need telling how Tony's proceed? Um. <laughs> Do you? Already know. Say nothing. Yeah. How dare you enter a tourney for nobly born knights? Excuse Your me. Your knighthood came through the grace of my mother Meath, Queen of Lyria and Rivia, whom you treacherously deserted mere days later. Your presence here is an offense to my honor. And yours is an offense to my eyes. If you're done, step aside, Prince. The Tony's protector, the mate Vivian, a beauty in chances both beasts and men. She turns into a monster. My heart's greetings, yeah. dear knights. May my grace guide you and show you the path of honor, valor, and glory. Can we have our road? Accept my wishes of good fortune, sir, and devote all your strength to the Tony, and only it. Was the time that? has a come woman? for you, Sir Knight. Mount your steed, swift be your flight. Ladies and gentlemen of lineage illustrious, soon steeds shall swarm like ants most industrious. To beat time's passage, they'll ride like the gale. What a sight to behold, what a lark, what a tale. Before us, Geralt, from Rithia come, fast as the wind, bright as the sun. Oh, he's a lyrical genius. That's what Rose looks like. Oh, what the fuck are we doing? 
Oh, 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 shit. I'm going to be hitting these things. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, I'm messing this up. Yeah, we're going to be shit. Okay. Passing checkpoints helps time, yeah? Oh, fuck. Pay attention to the map, pay attention to the map. Whatever's next is a, a shooting. Suiting! I can't, oh, I've got a. Oh. No, don't stop, you dummy! Oh, I did it. Oh, another one. Oh! Oh my god, this might look sick. <laughs> ah, yeah! Fuck, 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 fuck. Whoa. What's the next one? What's the next one? Oh! The! Ah! Uh! Fuck me. What's the next one? Another shoot. Let's see it from here. Bow! Okay, we might we might be okay. Another one. Bow. How long is this gonna go on for? Until you pass all the checkpoints, I guess. Oh, another one. Four. I hate how it stops me. Choppy! Another one? Shut the douche! Praise each fair night. We shall feast from eve till dawn's first light. The finest of wine and fruits shall be served if you've blood in your veins. Come collect what's deserved. Yum yum yum. Is that all? Congratulate you. Here, your crabs. A saddle adorned with your crest. Many thanks. Wow. By the way, my mate saw a man with white hair sneak out of my tent. Uh -oh. what might have been. The, um, How juvenile. Congratulations on your win. In stellar style, no less. Ah, I no longer regret I was not able to participate. Almost. We must drink to this. Come with me to the feast. We shall await Vivian to get. Yes, 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 feast. Lead the way. We'll have to see what a roach looks like in that um, new horse armor mm. later. So, any thoughts on Vivian? Her beauty is striking. That is not what I ask. Still too early to say anything I'd be willing to stand behind. Managed to figure one thing out. She uses powerful magic, masking illusions. Do you mean to say she might in truth look different than she seems? Only guessing right now. We've still some time before Vivian arrives. Let us drink. I'm up for drinking. Should we have a drink? Let's have a drink. Why not? Might you thirsty? To Vivian, may you find the means to aid her. To Vivian. To Vivian. I don't have a drink to drink. Uh, oh. When I first laid eyes on her, I finally understood what all those poems and ballads were trying to say. 
Love's not poetry alone. Sometimes it's prose. Sometimes it's just plain ugly. You say that only because you do not know Vivian as I do. A life with her would be sweetness itself. Actually, you don't know her all that well either. A challenge? Her presence at this tourney is an affront to my honor. I demand satisfaction. Head to the nearest brothel then. <laughs> Coward. Mounted combat in the main arena. I challenge you. Fine, more than willing to fight, or some other time I'm busy. Some other time I'm busy, man. I'm drinking. I'm drinking with a friend. But he did call us a coward. Some other time I'm busy. Why should we satisfy this dickhead? Got business to finish here. We'll duel another day. You cannot refuse another man's challenge. It is dishonorable. You would be excluded from the tourney. Then what would become of Vivian? Coward. Fine. Main arena. See you there. You're gonna regret this. I'm gonna chop his fucking head off. If it lets me. May the blood I will spill wash away the stain of your cowardice. Let's get this over with. Quick. Three. Two. One. You little bitch. <laughs> Can you actually kill him? Do you reckon? Don't know. But this is pissing me off. Am I even hitting this bastard? His health ain't gone down, has it? Because I'm not even going near him. Mate, that took nearly all of his health in one go. Whoa! <laughs> Reasons unknown except to them. The gods have chosen to punish me with defeat. But do not think your cowardice will be forgotten. Damn it. You still going on about that? Need to clear this up once and for all. Had to abandon your mother's camp back then because someone else needed my help. Badly. Couldn't refuse them. Didn't want to, in fact. You mean to say you had a secret mission, set off to accomplish it, having vowed to tell no one of its nature until you did? Something like that, minus the vow. And, uh, I'd still rather not divulge the nature of my secret mission. Can you accept that as justification? In agreeing to Jewel, you proved yourself a true knight. Thus, I accept your word as that of a man of honor. Glad to hear it. Now I got work to do. Don't mess with Geralt, bitch. Oh. My heart swells to behold this beautiful celebration of valor and honor, and to witness you, who embody the chivalric virtues in your lives, strive for greatness. Yet, after a time of combat must come a time of peace and respite. Thus, I invite all who fought in the tourney to this feast held in your, and none others, honor. And should any among you crave solitude, Private tents await you nearby. The group melee shall take place on the morrow. Glory shall be within grasp for each and every one of you. The best among you shall have the honor to face our reigning champion, the famed Grégoire de Gourgon, victor of last year's tourney. He's a fucking beast. Celebrate, make merry, <laughs> revel as you will. Oh, shit. Yet be mindful of the trial that awaits you tomorrow. What the 
hell is this monster? Follow her. We shall meet in your tent before your last contest. You must help her. I wanted to eat and drink. Oh well, I got a job to do. We're on a mission. How am I to enjoy an evening of fun with my jewels all pinched and put in? That grey dome scoundrel, ever seeking Lady Vivian, sunk and brilliant. Confront Vivian. Uh, Vivian? Hello? Strange. I was sure I'd find her here. Vivian's nice. Laugh. Fan expenses. 14 hours of cloth. Shoes. Dragon skin. Racing saddle. Magic cream. 1400 crowns? I think that was the other thing that I could have looked at. Um. What was that? Flew off. Worth going after. Looks like they're both leading me somewhere. Is her? Another pamphlet. What are all these bloody monsters? What is that thing? Come on. That's time for you. Another? How far has this little bird taken me? <clears throat> I wonder if this is her. Or the bird. Be. Yeah. Or it's being controlled by some sort of oh shit. Whoa. Yeah. Over the hill, might be quicker to pass through the cave. Are you kidding me? I don't like the idea of passing through caves. Might have to use some cat. Fine. Yeah, we'll, we'll use some cat. Um, the person's called cat, but I like calling it cat. Eye. What's that? Thing? White. <laughs> Uh, magic trap. What's the other thing? Oh, did it summon that or something? Oh. I didn't need to, to use cat. Oh well, it's night time. Cat helps to see at night, so. We'll be able to see better.
Pizza Hut. She doesn't look right. Witcher. Lady Vivian. Counted on me getting lost. I did. I thought you no different from the knights. Good at tourneys, hopeless in the face of true danger. I was mistaken. Here you come to this clearing often. This is where it all began. And as I was not able to evade you, save myself from you, that I want it done here. In this very spot, with no witnesses. Want what done? While you are a witcher, you were hired to kill me, were you not? Then do so, now. And do it quickly, I beg you. I shan't Whoa. resist. Witchers only hunt monsters. And even then, not all. You're no monster. Mm. Then what am I to your eyes? Uh... Well, we don't know yet, but oh, aff afflicted by a curse? Yeah. Most likely you've been cursed. Don't know who by or why yet, but hope to find that out soon. If you've no contract on my life, why take an interest at all? Did Guillaume put you up to it? Is that why? He wanted to help you. Asked me to do him a favor. Frankly, if I can do something for you, I'll do it, willingly. Why should I trust you? Because the Duchess trusts me? Because I'm a freak, too? Because cases like yours are my bread and butter. Take your pick. You shall not turn on me. Use what I say against me. You shall not tell anyone. Got nothing to fear? Yeah. You got nothing to fear. Came here to help you. And I won't peep a word to anyone unless I decide it's absolutely necessary. Ah, uh, so be it. I shall tell you what my mama once told me. When she was with child, expecting me, she and my father spent much time together near the wood, here in this clearing. Mama loved to listen to the Orioles sing. She would stroke her belly and say, My daughter should be as beautiful as that bird. Such is my wish. But a creature dwelt in the wood who envied my parents their happiness. One day it appeared before them to say the whole wood belonged to it. And they had dared to delight in something that was not theirs. It demanded payment. And when my parents said that they had nothing, he claimed their unborn daughter as its own. What did the creature look like? Parents ever described the creature? They called it a nymph born of the deep woods, with no mother or father. But I was too young, too distraught by the curse's onset to ask after details. What happened then? What happened after that? Nothing at first. I came into the world a perfectly normal child, and my parents forgot that day's events. But fifteen summers into my life, the curse began to show. Initially only when the moon was full. But now it's advanced so that even in daytime I must use magic ointment to mask its symptoms, to look normal. Thus I thought someone had discovered my secret and hired you to kill me. In fact, I was resigned to death in coming here. Perhaps death would be preferable to my complete and permanent transformation. For I fear that is what lies in store. Magic illusions. Using them can be dangerous. Ointment you use includes a potent magic ingredient. You don't have the immunity mages have. Use heavy doses, or normal doses too long, and it could be dangerous to you. I sensed this. The very reason I knew I would have to give it up in the end, and bid my human form a final farewell. I can try to lift a curse. The curse. It could be reversible. Once ran into a baron, transformed into a cormorant, ostensibly for good. Managed to cure him completely. And you truly think you could do something like this for me? Can't guarantee a thing. Tough case yours. You were cursed before birth. That alone complicates things. Also, you claim the curse is increasing its hold. Symptoms are progressing. 
could try transferring the curse onto someone else. What? Out of the question. I shall not allow it to ruin an innocent life. Is this the only method you know? Only one that's completely safe. So there is another. You're quick to reject help. What does that even mean? Right there. I don't know. Should we just not say that? Yeah, I'd rather say it. Just not say that one. Because she was like, I don't want to inflict yeah. on someone else. Why would we want to do that? All right. There is another. Ancient ritual. We'd need an Oriole egg. Should release the curse's grip permanently. Gotta warn you, though. Could have serious consequences. Consequences? What kind? Curse was cast before you came into this world. Ritual involved transferring it to an as yet unhatched chick. You'd be free. Thing is, you could be left with the average lifespan of an Oriole. Seven years. Why? I understand. Alas, every rose has its thorn, and there are no happy endings. If truth be told, I never thought I would get one. I came here prepared to die. Yet you wish to give me seven years of life. Real life, free life. This is no dilemma. I agree wholeheartedly. I see why. I understand. Don't have to decide just yet. Think it through. I will. They must miss me at the Tony Grounds by now. Shall we return? That's. I think I'm going to stay here, just in case we might be able to find something. Yeah. think I'll stay here a little longer. As you wish. Then I shall see you on the morrow. I want to stay here. And in the next one, we're going to search around this area. Just to, just to double check to see. If maybe we can find this nymph or something nearby. But anyway... We're going to end the episode here, because we're over half an hour. And we, we will see you guys in the next one, where we'll do a little bit of investigating. So, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Bye!